Christy Brunberry, and welcome to my second episode of Gas Monkey Weekly. As one of the most successful car-centered reality shows of recent decades, Fast and Loud was known not only for bringing its audience lots of excellent car restorations and builds, but also for its memorable cast. Starting with Gas Monkey Garage's owner, Richard Rawlings, and then passing to the genius builder, Aaron Kaufman, and several other talented crew members, it wasn't an easy task to choose just one favorite star from the show. With that being said, it's impossible for the loyal audience of Fast and Loud to forget Christy Brimberry, who managed Gas Monkey Garage's projects years ago, but disappeared from the public spotlight upon the show's cancellation in 2020. So what is she doing today? And what are the latest updates on Christie's health? Stay here to know it all. It's been a long time since Fast and Loud left TV screens for good, leaving us with too many questions about Christy Brimberry's whereabouts. Fortunately, the fact that she's no longer on TV doesn't mean that she has gone completely missing from social media, keeping herself quite active on her highly popular Facebook and Instagram accounts. While it's unclear whether Christy has further plans to appear on TV, she seems to be having quite a great time these days. She celebrated her 51st birthday in March 2023 and commemorated the event with a social media post in which she wrote, I feel better and stronger than I did in my 30s. News of her recurring good health situation surely comes as a relief for her fans, as Christy battled thyroid cancer in 2016 but has fortunately been free from the disease for several years now. Other recent events in Christie's life have been worth celebrating, such as the birth of her first grandson in 2020, the opening of her new salon in 2022, launching a very popular YouTube channel, and even becoming an OnlyFans content creator in 2021. All of this makes it clear that Christie is doing great these days, despite not being on TV anymore. Though Christy Brimberry became quite popular during the year she was featured in Fast and Loud while working for Gas Monkey Garage, many fans lost track of her around 2017, when she took a brief break from the show. Back then, her absence was directly related to her health, as in August 2016, she'd been diagnosed with thyroid cancer. As Christy recalled in a Facebook post from October of that year, she had felt a lump in her throat and got it checked. Despite initially thinking the nodule in her throat was caused by a thyroid affection called Hashimoto disease, it turned out that she had thyroid cancer and required urgent surgery to remove her thyroid and a nodule to which the cancer had spread. While the initial one-day surgery was simple, part of her trachea was removed and one of her voice box nerves was cut, leaving her with no voice for several months. Nevertheless, the surgery and subsequent sessions of radiation treatment were effective. And though it took her a long while to become healthy again, in December 2017, she proudly announced that she was cancer-free, thanking her followers for their support and encouragement through that uphill battle. Even the greatest things must come to an end, and it's no different for Christy Brimberry and her job at Gas Monkey Garage. As many loyal fans of Fast and Loud remember, Christy turned into quite a popular cast member throughout the years she worked for Richard Rawlings as a manager and assistant. Though her appearances on screen were cut short during the time she battled cancer, Christy eventually returned to the shop and appeared briefly in the 15th season aired in 2019, about a year before the show was canceled in 2020. While it's unclear when exactly Christy left her job at Gas Monkey Garage, it's safe to assume that she's no longer involved with the shop since the show's end. The very few work-related pics shared by Christy recently all have to do with her hairstyling business, Muse Salon Dallas, which she co-owns with her husband, Darren. As well, she's gone missing from Gas Monkey Garage's social media accounts, making it apparent that Christy and Richard are no longer involved professionally, though it's unclear whether they remain friendly or not. Even though we know Christy for her TV appearances and great talent for managing businesses, making car deals, and keeping an entire shop in order, that doesn't mean she can't explore other of her no business related interests. To prove that, the year 2021 saw Christy become a content creator on the adult subscription platform OnlyFans. Though that also brought up a lot of rumors about her romantic and financial situation back then. Christy cleared up all these misconceptions in a Facebook post 
in which she not only affirmed that her husband completely agreed with her decision to join OnlyFans as a creator, but also that she was doing great both financially and health-wise. This has been a long time coming. I'm so happy with where I am in life right now and finally confident in my skin," she wrote. Even though her profile on the platform is still active, Christy currently no longer promotes her OnlyFans content as she used to when she started her account. If there's something true about Christy Brimberry, it's that she's very well liked by everyone, something easily seen during her time in Fast and Loud and her side projects. For a start, Christy's popularity on social media is quite impressive. Her official Facebook page has well over 1.2 million followers, and 300,000 people are following her on Instagram. Though Christy's popularity is unquestioned, that has brought her some trouble as well such as someone creating a fake YouTube channel with her name on it, gaining more than 25,000 subscribers by re-uploading videos from Christie's social media without her permission. As well, in 2022, Christie's Instagram account was temporarily hacked by someone who tried to push her to share videos promoting cryptocurrency in exchange for recovering her account. Christie didn't fall prey to said extortion and recovered the account after a while. But multiple cases of Christie impersonators have resurfaced on Facebook in recent times as well. Despite having her share of bittersweet experiences, Christie's social media have also served her well in the past, such as the time she paid for her cancer treatment by accepting several Facebook advertising deals, as well as promoting her business and other projects. All in all, if there's someone to look up to when it comes to managing their public image impressively, then Christie Brimberry is that person. So what happened to Fast and Loud? Despite all the great car moments which it gave us throughout the years on air, the show most likely won't return to TV. This news was revealed by Richard Rawlings in the podcast The Joe Rogan Experience, in which he also revealed that he'd exited Discovery to become a free agent and expand and grow a little bit, confessing that he had felt he had no room to grow anymore with the network. While it was sad for fans to see Fast and Loud go after 16 seasons on air, that didn't mean the end of Gas Monkey Garage by any means. Since the show's end, Richard has been busily creating content for his business's YouTube channel, which showcases both casual restorations and builds done by Gas Monkey Garage, as well as some of his car-related escapades, such as exhibitions, auctions, and trips. As well, Gas Monkey Garage has greatly expanded its online presence on Facebook and Instagram, catering to its most loyal fans by organizing contests giveaways, and all types of car-related events. While it would be great to see Christy Brimberry and some of our other favorite stars from Fast and Loud on TV again, it seems this show is something of the past, now that Gas Monkey Garage has found its place on the internet. Thank you for spending some time with us. Make sure to like and subscribe so you never miss another video. We also handpick these videos, which we recommend you watch next. You can talk to us on all social medias or ask a question in the comments below. Thank you for being with us and we'll see you back tomorrow.